Hi, it's Addie with Close to My Heart, and today we are going to do ink smooshing, another fun kind of watercolor technique. And the first thing you want to do is grab some watercolor paper, that's what I have here. And mine is cut down to three and three quarters by five. And I'm just going to rub over it with this embossing buddy because the first thing we're going to add to this is we're going to stamp down the tree from Keep Your Chin Up Occasions stamps. And I just got this one. I've been waiting to use it. So we're going to rub it on our arm, give it that cloudy appearance, and then pop it right into Versamark ink on top of our squishy piece. And I think I'm just going to go straight down in the center. And I have some white embossing powder right nearby. It's a scrap paper. You can kind of see that in the light. And I think while we're here, I'm going to pop the sentiment on here too. And we'll put that right there. Heat that with your heat gun. So we have our tree and our sentiment embossed on this piece of watercolor paper. Next thing we want to do is take a block for your stamps, an acrylic block, and take your stamp pad and just put some ink on here. And then you want to spray it. You can spray it with plain water, but right now I have shimmer spray in my hand. So, I'm going to spray, move this out of the way. Hmm, that makes it a little cloudy. That's alright, we'll try it. So we have this smoosh of ink and shimmer spray on here. And the next thing you want to do is find a piece of packaging or if you have a piece of transparency, something clear, plastic, and you're going to pick up some ink on that piece. I happen to have a piece of a transparency, so I'm going to squish it on here, smoosh it, and I want to smoosh it right down over this. And mine is very dry looking. I'm not a fan. Kind of looks splattery. With another color. We're gonna go into thistle. Before that was cotton candy. Now we're going into thistle. And I happen to have plain water too. Let's try this with the plain water. Okay, I think that's a little bit better. And we're gonna again take our transparency and smoosh it down. Why is that not working? There we go. 
liquidy, smooshy. Oh god. I kind of like that so far. And then we're gonna grab Gypsy as well. Get that all over our block over here. And spray that. Go right down with your transparency piece. Pick up that ink. Pick some more up. Really want our sentiment to have something behind it. There we go. more purple, more gypsy up here. I'm going to go back in with that first color, cotton candy, because it didn't quite get as wet as I needed it to. I'm making a little bit of a mess and not really controlling this. I think what I'll do is die cut this. So I ran that watercolor piece through my cuddle bug with a circle die and then I grabbed a piece of black cardstock and did the same thing to nest it on here. So I'm going to glue this down base I cut square four and a quarter by four and a quarter and I'm gonna put this this little piece of fundamentals on here and that's cut at four by four I didn't like it so actually I'm gonna cut a new card base I'm gonna pull this off of here some reason if you pull to the side it always works better than if you pull straight up. I'm gonna just rub this ATG off of here as I can. So I'm just gonna put this down. Cleaner and more graphic. 